Hey, I'm Chris Troy, host of St. Clair County Reese's Moment in History with today's Moment in History Extra. Now we're here at 1125 12th Avenue, Port Huron, which is one of the most unknown buildings in Port Huron today. But during 1944, with World War II raging on, this building brought daily aid to the world by supplying a coffee substitute to the American people. With coffee in short supply during the war, Port Huron became known as the chicory capital of the United States. The E.B. Mueller Company, in association with McMoran Holdings, produced a caffeine-free coffee substitute made of roasted chicory roots. This process allowed coffee drinkers to still have their cup of java in the morning. Chicory plants from as far away as Bay City were shipped to Port Huron for processing. In fact, the large amount of chicory weed found along the Port Huron roadsides today is a direct route to the chicory manufacturing days. The Port Huron Chicory plant remained in operation until 1973 when coffee once again became readily available and the taste for chicory began to fade. For Moment in History Extra, hey, I'm Chris Troy reminding you all that history lives in all of us.